When there's a problem, there's a solution. These tiny problems are everywhere, every day. Well, you may live with those tiny problems, but without them, it would just be better. Your tiny problems mean the world to us. And we make simple apps to solve your tiny problems. Tiny simple apps that make your everyday better. And when these tiny apps are made, the world gets a tiny bit better. Softorino. Tiny apps that make a gigantic difference. Hello, everyone. I'm so excited to join you here at the annual Softorino Next 2022 keynote. My name is Josh Brown, and I'm the CEO of Softorino. It is the second time we're gathering here at Softorino headquarters to talk about the past 2022 and the future of 2023. This year has been extremely productive and innovative, but it was also challenging, horrible, and devastating at the same time. And I would like to speak more about it. Soft Arena is an international company, but most of our team was born and lives in Ukraine. The biggest war in Europe that would have been called impossible several months ago has unfolded right in front of our eyes. Tens of thousands of innocent people are killed and millions of lives have changed forever. All because of the inability of one nation to manage an authoritarian dictator. Our team is still in Ukraine. And despite the war, we're staying stronger than ever and continue to innovate and build solutions for you. We would like to mourn all innocent lives of Ukrainian men, women, and children that were lost because of unprovoked Russian military aggression on our land. 2022 has been the biggest year in the history of Soft Arena. One year ago, on this stage, we've concluded phase one of our app universe that spans over from 2014 to 2021. We've announced phase two with six new app releases, and we introduced Universal License, a revolutionary way to own all of our past, current, and future apps for a fraction of the cost. And today, one year later, we're so proud to share that 20,000 people are now a part of the Soft Arena Universal License community, enjoying our apps on a daily basis. Here's what Universal License subscribers have to say. Access to several apps I use on a very regular basis and try the others I never previously knew about. I gotta think it's awesome and easily one of the best massive upgrade decisions I've made in many, many years. Kenneth from Washington, DC. Saving cost over buying each application version upgrade separately. Shannon from Los Angeles. In the past 12 months, we released Folder Colorizer for Mac, a folder styling productivity app, SYC Pro, a new pro iteration of the world's safest and fastest video downloader, and PicFinder, a new Mac app to search and manage royalty-free images. Over 1 million users already downloaded our apps since we were last here. And Universal License, a singular and simple way to use all of the Soft Arena apps, regardless of location, operating system, or any other limitations. These are all huge milestones for us. And it all became possible thanks to our new community of Universal License subscribers. I'm so proud of our team behind the recent releases, and I'd like to show you a quick demo of our two latest products. First, Soft Arena YouTube Converter Pro. This is a state-of-the-art app to download and convert media from the internet to any device. And here's how it works. So I have a video that I want to use in my Final Cut project. Here it is. What I need to do is simply copy the URL, and SYC Pro automatically detects and parses the video info. Then I just select how and where I want to transfer. As other Soft Arena apps, SYC Pro detects and supports direct to iOS transfer. So I'm picking my iPhone from the list and downloading the video directly to the stock video player. Or I can also choose Apple Music since I have an active Apple Music subscription for it. The added music files will be synced across all Apple devices, including Apple Watch, HomePod, Apple TV, and so on. In the Pro version, we've added a metadata editor. For example, if I want to add a song to my Apple Music, simply, I'm going to go into YouTube, and copy the link. I click on Edit Metadata. And here I can transfer the proper cover art, or I can change the song name. I can change the album name, the artist name, and then click Save and Continue. Choose AAC or MP3. 
Apple Music, and hit download. And here it is in my Apple Music safe and sound. Now this is the all new SYC Pro. And now I would like to show you our completely new app that we've just released. It's called PicFinder. Finding royalty-free images is something that we all do when creating content and making designs. PicFinder is a go-to app for royalty-free image search from multiple online sources, all in one app. We have emotions, we have colors, we have categories. I type say, Apple, and here are many images of apples. My daughter loves PicFinder because this is an exploration of visuals for any given word. Let's specify. I type green apple on a table. And here's exactly what I need. All information is at hand. The author, the size, the source. And you can download it directly by clicking the download button while selecting the proper size and format. I can create a collection by clicking right here and say for Apple's article. And then I can go ahead and add Apple pictures by clicking on the heart icon right here. This is PicFinder and both apps are available for free for all Universal License subscribers. 2022 is not over yet, but we can't wait to show you what's coming in 2023. Phase two of Soft Arena App Universe expands and evolves. Let's start with Folder Colorizer for Mac. It has been a huge success on Windows since 2010, and it became our most downloaded app for Mac in just one year. Today, we're releasing Folder Colorizer for Mac version 1.5. There are many new features and improvements, and I would like to show them to you right away. Let's have a quick demo of the new folder colorizer for Mac. Folder colorizer allows you to customize icon look by adding color, symbols, images, and combine them in a million possible ways. And you can apply it to one folder or a group of folders. New folder icons are connected deep into the folder. So if you copy the folder from another Mac or share it via network drive or upgrade your system, it always stays there forever and it's available from any app on file system level. This really helps you navigate through multiple files and folders during the day and makes you more productive. And with version 1.5, we're introducing two new features. The first feature is global image search. Now let's say I'm back from vacation in Paris and I have a folder named Paris trip. It would be great to have an Eiffel Tower to illustrate it. So I right click on the folder, go into services, and click on change color with folder colorizer. Now right away, the smart AI brings out all the possible related images, emojis, decals that are related to the folder. It scans the name of the folder and brings you all the relevant searches. Now, for example, if I don't wanna have the AI work for me, I can just go here, type Paris and get hundreds of royalty-free photos from my folder. I like this one. I choose it and here we go. I colorize it and voila, this folder looks beautiful now and definitely tells me that it's in Paris. The second feature is decals. Last year, we introduced only 30 decals and this year we're adding so many more. So if I wanna keep my folder strict, I can reset it to default, go into decals and look for something like this. Yep, that's perfect. So this is Folder Colorizer 1.5. We were amazed at how Folder Colorizer was accepted by our audience. And we received a lot of requests from businesses to use it as a productivity tool for their processes. The core of Universal License has been designed to make our apps more accessible. But because of your requests, Folder Colorizer goes beyond Universal License. And it will be available on the Mac App Store for a standalone price. And for free for all Universal License subscribers. Our next app today is huge, and I can't wait to share it with you. The famous Beamer app from the Indie Devs 2 Pill joins the Universal License family. Beamer helps you stream any video file into Apple TV or Google Chromecast, regardless of the format, MKV or AVI. I myself first used Beamer back in 2012, 
because I needed to watch an MKV file on my smart TV. And it worked. The app has influenced our Walter app in a way. And today, we're taking over the development of Beamer to give it an even brighter future. Beamer replaces Streamer app that we announced last year on this stage. And I would like to tell you more about the new Beamer. When you launch the Beamer app, it automatically starts searching for a nearby Apple TV or a Chromecast device. So if I want to play this MKV file on my Apple TV tonight, I simply drag and drop it into the Beamer window and it starts playing instantly. All transcoding and format adaptations happen on the fly, so you just enjoy the movie. Beamer supports 4K, 5.1 sound, and subtitles. Also, I can add more files as a playlist for nonstop playback. And this is the new Beamer app for Mac. The union of Beamer with Softarino marks a new chapter in the development of Universal License, and we will speak more about this later today. Community of tens of thousands of active Beamer users will join Universal License. The original price of Beamer was $19.95, but in 2023, Beamer app will be available for free for all Universal License subscribers. Existing Beamer users will get an exclusive upgrade offer later this week. And the final app you've all been waiting for, Altunes. This is by far the most complicated app we've ever designed. Altunes helps you securely access and manage your data on the iPhone or iPad. And today, we're announcing the launch of Altunes for Windows Beta. It's so amazing. So instead of talking about it, I would like to show you a live demo of Altunes right now. Here's the Altunes dashboard. It's gorgeous. I can see my iPhone right here and all the information about it. On the left side menu, there are apps for my iPhone. I can click on any app, say messages or music, and a separate window glides over. So here are all my messages, the same way I can see them on my iPhone. I can save them, export them, transfer to my computer, or make a backup. I'm starting to transfer, and then I close the messages window. And I can launch another app like music and start an export, and then hit done. A separate big section is backups. It's a state of the art. You can make backups, mount them into Altunes, extract data, transfer and sync between devices. It gives you unparalleled flexibility to manage your iOS device the way you want it. So as you can see, Altunes is actually like 15 apps in one. And we can't wait for you to try it yourself. Altunes for Windows Beta will be available today for free for all Universal License subscribers. And public beta, starts in 2023. Now, Altunes for Mac is also coming in 2023. So this is Altunes, and we just can't wait to hear your feedback about it. And finally, Universal License. It's a singular subscription that allows you to use all apps that you've seen today, regardless of the country, computer, or any other limitation. We've drastically improved the experience with Universal License. And now, you can log into your account directly from the main page. You can download and activate apps with just a click. Now, Universal License is a subscription, and some of you are skeptical about subscriptions these days. For Softorino, switching to an all-in-one subscription was a risk. But now, I can say that it was a success. In just one year, we delivered more than we have in the past five years. So many releases, news, apps, and partnership. We're committed to working every day to make you a happy customer and bring as many great apps for you as we can. Despite all of the releases, the price for Universal License remains the same, just $2.92 per month for annual plans. Universal License is evolving, so two new great announcements are coming. We were amazed at how many people use Universal License apps for their daily work routine. We received numerous requests regarding business cooperation. So today, we're announcing Universal License for Business. For 99 per month, the business gets all apps, priority support, a dedicated manager, and activations for teams of up to 30. So please subscribe for updates today to be the first in line for Universal License for Business. Universal License unveiled a potential that goes beyond Softarino. Our story with Beamer app inspired us to go even further. So we're announcing Universal License for Developers. In 2023, we plan to open third-party integrations of Universal License. If you're an indie developer 
you can introduce your app to tens of thousands of Universal License subscribers in just a few days. Universal License SDK helps you get your app running with UL along with other platforms like App Store, SetApp, or your custom checkout process. This is a safe way for users to get apps they trust. This is the all new Universal License, an improved experience, Universal License for business, and Universal License for indie developers. Now again, I want to remind you that everything that has been shown and announced today is available free for all Universal License users. Upgrade to Universal License today, right after the event, for just $2.92 per month. 2022 is concluding with three new app releases for Phase 2, along with two more releases coming in 2023. New Universal License experience with Universal License for Business and third-party integrations is coming next year. And all of these amazing releases and improvements became possible thanks to Universal License. It allows us to focus on making new, great solutions for you, while you can get way more apps for a fraction of the cost. And I would like to thank our small yet exceptionally amazing team at Softurino. Please join us right now, Andrew, Ivanka, Andre, Toma, Dima, Alex, Vlad, Kate, Bogdan, and Alexander. And thank you for joining us today and for sharing our vision towards a new universe of apps we're building together. So see you next year on Software and Keynote 2023.